hey guys welcome back to my channel i am back with another video and i will be showing you guys um my top five favorite hair products that i've tried in 2018 and i absolutely fell in love now for the most part i did not um try too many new products this year like i just bought recently some new things and if you haven't watched my product haul i highly recommend you guys watch it so you guys can see what i bought um i basically uh but the products that i did some of the products that i did try i absolutely fell in love and it will forever be in my stash so i just wanted to share you guys my favorite products of 2018 unfortunately the um I'm, I'm gonna show you guys my top five i'm gonna tell you guys my top five well there's one that i won't show you the actual product um because i don't have it on because i ran out and i didn't repurchase just yet and that is the mild organics pomegranate and honey con conditioner the rinse on conditioner now i'm gonna show you guys the line I'm gonna show you this is it's from this line right here but it's not this one I'm talking about the rinse out conditioner that conditioner the the my dog organics pomegranate and honey rinse out conditioner is amazing for um for detangling after I use it it leaves my like after I rinse it out my hair looks extremely defined it looks well moisturized um so yeah, that is my first favorite product. I absolutely love it. It's it's amazing. Like I just I love the product in general. <laughs> so this the second my second favorite product is a shampoo. And it is the Shea Moisture Low Porosity Protein Free Shampoo. This shampoo is amazing. I used to use the um Jamaican black castor oil and I love that one too. But this one is protein free. The other one has protein and which is one of the reasons why I love it um, it clears um, it cleans my scalp and it doesn't leave my hair dry once it's rinsed out you guys know that being a curly girl there's certain shampoos that leave your hair extremely um, dry after you use it because it takes out some of the natural oil this um, this shampoo does not do that at all I'm just gonna read to you guys what it says. This clarifying shampoo is so faithfully to gently cleanse and remove product buildup. It does that for my hair. Ideal for low porosity curls and coils that resist essential moisture, infused with fast absorbing biobob and tea tree oil, spearmint and clear sage to promote scalp health, to, to promote scalp health. And enriched with certified organic shea butter to deliver balance, nourishing hydration where hair needs it most. Saturate hair with warm water, apply shampoo and work into a rich lather. Rinse thoroughly, repeat if necessary, follow with protein conditioner for best results. Uh, so yeah, this, um, it just cleans my hair really well. It doesn't leave my hair dry, which is like really important when you're trying to find a really great shampoo. And I have medium porosity hair, so I don't have low porosity, but my hair does get product build like I have some traits of low porosity as far as my hair is gets easily product build up I can only use one or two products with the exception of the as I am stylers though that um, I'm I'm gonna have a video on that as well and once the video is up I'll put it in the description box on my curly hair routine but that is the only time you will ever see me use three products at one time most of the time I'm going with a leave-in and a cream or a leave-in and a gel with the exception of as I am, I go with leave-in cream and gel. Okay, I'm getting sidetracked. Sorry. So anyway, but yeah, since my hair does get product built up, this product is amazing because it takes off the it takes off the product that I've had for the week or whatever. So yeah, highly recommend this. Next product that I highly recommend, and I also this is also I don't want to say a repurchase because I got it for free the first time, but anyway, it, it is the Diva Curl deep sea repair and this is amazing this is uh this has a lot of protein though and i am protein sensitive but this is one of the few products that is packed with protein that works um the few deep conditioners that work amazing for my hair this overall feels stronger it helps with elasticity i highly recommend it i use it i don't use it often i use it once a month but however 
I'm going to leave the prices of each product um, down below, but I will say this is really pricey and it's only 8 ounces. Um, but I just love it. Like, I, it's really, really great. It is the Diva Curl Deep Sea Repair. It's called Seaweed Strengthening Mask. I'm just going to read to you guys what it says for in the back. What does it do? The variety formula made with restored seaweed, a strengthening blend of rice, soy, and wheat proteins, and moisturizing sea lavender transforms damaged hair. This creamy formula leaves all curl types looking healthy, bouncy, and incredibly defined. Yes, it leaves your hair really bouncy after, and your hair just looks healthy, it looks stronger. So whenever your hair feels like brittle, or whenever it feels just like not as strong, I would highly recommend this uh, Diva Curl Deep Sea Repair. It is kind of pricey, um, but I just, this is just what I, I use to be really honest. Um, and I will buy it when it's on sale, like I mentioned in my product haul. <laughs> But yeah, I love it. And I discovered it this year and I'm trying it this year. So since I already started with a Diva Curl product, I also discovered another Diva Curl product and I mentioned this in my one product wash and go. And it is a Diva Curl Super Stretch. This product right here, man, this is a coconut curl elongator. So it elongates your curls, which is why I love it. Um, makes my curls look somewhat longer and um, it defines your curls really well like I would say close to a gel but it doesn't really give you like a lot of shine like this so I rated a 9.5 out of 10 not a 10 out of 10 because it doesn't give you a lot of shine but that's fine as long as it's moisturized and it is great for a one product wash and go. I've mentioned this in my one product wash and go. I will also leave that link down below if you're interested in watching that video. Um, overall, I love this product. I highly recommend it. Um, does a little go a long way? No, I, I would say, especially if you use it for just uh, by itself, I would say just be a little heavy handed with it. Not like you don't have to like grab a whole thing for each section, but. You know, grab a decent amount. Not like I will say. I'm not wasting product, but you just like grab a decent amount for each section. Um, but it does leave your hair to fine. Your hair, my hair lasts a good five days, and that's great for a one product wash and go. Like usually, I need to leave it. So yeah. Um, but this is just amazing. It defines your curls. It elongates your curls. If you're someone who has shrinkage, I have a little shrinkage but i don't have a lot of shrinkage to be really honest i only have like i think six seven inches um but if you have a lot of shrinkage i highly recommend this um i do have medium porosity medium density hair so um the my product reviews are based on that i'm gonna make a video on my hair type and stuff so you guys can have an idea how i go about reviewing products so yeah last but definitely not least it is the Camille Rose Naturals Olive Whip Butter Gel. Now, the word gel had me really, and again, I have a video on this too. The word gel had me really skeptical to use it by itself. A girl from Insta, um, one of my girlfriends on Instagram, uh, she gives a whole bunch of great product reviews. Anyway, she um so the Camille Rose Naturals Aloe Whip Butter Gel is amazing. Um, I'm going to read what it says. Um, hydrate, soften, strengthen, and it says is the Aloe Whip Butter Gel is a moisturizing cream based gel that is blended with rich oils for for a conditioning properties and vitamins for nourishing the scalp. Curls will become defined with a light hold and medium moisture. I mean, and maximum moisture. It says light hold, but for me personally, I will give it a medium hold because it does give me hold. Like, my hair does last three to four days. And I tried this towards the end of the summer because I was going through it in the summertime. Like, my hair does not like gel in the summer. only likes it in the other three seasons. Um, but when I discovered this, like, my hair lasted four days in the winter, which is great. I mean, in the summer, which is a great thing, because my hair does not last that long in the winter. I mean, in the summer. I keep saying winter, in the summer. Um, so I will be definitely using this. It's definitely my summer my summer product wash and go holy grail. I absolutely fell in love the first time I used it. 
This is another product. I'm going to show you guys a bit. This is another product that I highly recommend. Um, I'll, just like I said about the Super Stretch, be like not too heavy handed, but you know, a little heavy handed with the product. Um, so, yeah. Um, <laughs> overall, I love this product. It, don't get scared with the word gel because it is a cream based gel so i think they call it a gel because it does give you that type of hold that a gel would but overall i this is another favorite of 2018 for me um so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know if you guys have ever tried any of these five products right here these are my top five favorites from products that i have tried this year so it's not just like oh my favorites in general I will be doing favorites every once in a while. I'm probably going to give you guys my Black Friday purchases favorites once I tr I've tried them all. And I hope to guys see you guys in my next video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know your thoughts um, on this review. Have you tried any of these products? Did they not work for you? Let me know. Bye.